Hello everybody, uh, this is my Integra GSR and today this video is to talk to you about Coir Integ. Okay, many of you have um, tried many way. For example, some some um, some people that I see they buy a cheap Coir Integ on eBay, like thirty dollar, and with the short RAM into your throttle body and with the filter right here for thirty bucks. Or you can uh, spend a little bit more extra money and get the same setup and with the filter in here. So what they do is they remove their stock uh, air filter and the stock air box and they just leave uh, open filter in here. No, you don't want to do that. Okay, that's not cold air intake. That actually you suck in more air, hotter air into your engine. Without the cover, you see how hot it is when you run your engine. It's pretty hot in inside the engine bay. So there's a reason why that cover is there by the Honda and Acura engineer. So when you run a cold air intake, you think that you have cold air. No, you're running a lot of hotter air. So my point is this. I'm going to turn this setup, okay. into a real cold air intake um, if you spend a little bit more money there is a company called CT engineer cold air intake they they're pretty much making a sync setup uh, very close to your stock intake but it's a different kind but it's the same setup they just twist a little bit okay copy in front of stock Okay, and uh, I believe it's close to uh, you know 180 or 170 dollar. Okay, for um for the Intec called CT Engineer uh, Acura Integra uh, Air Intec. But uh, my video today is I'm gonna show you guys how to um, make this your stock into uh, similar to that setup. Okay, and pretty much if you if you um, if you know. Okay, if you study this and uh, this Integra here, the way how the the air get into your or uh, your uh, intake is come uh, through here. It's suck in through the um, side wall um, by the fender here. Okay, now I'm gonna show you. Okay, under this is the pipe. Okay, this is a tube that it's under your air box. Okay, that I remove. Now I'm gonna show you guys how. To make your stock intake very really similar to the CT engineer inbox. Now, if you look under, okay, this is the reason why. This is what I say. The second air through the fender hole over there, sidewall, okay, and there's a big box right here, a big intake box right here that connect. To this tube right here and go all the way to your intake box up there okay you see up there that where second the air go into your intake filter intake box second from that into a big box sorry I don't have the box anymore because I break the box okay you had to break the box to get this piece out. Now what you do is this is how it works, okay? So if you look at this right here, this piece right here, you have to cut it, okay? You have to cut this piece and twist this angle facing directions where the air can go in and you can just put tape on put the electrical tape on to hold it if you um if i remove this tape right here you'll see that i cut this whole piece okay into two pieces but if you don't cut it then the hole will pretty much line up up it's the same like this pipe right here okay these hole right here will line up up okay like that will face up so if you want us to suck it air, air from directly inside you cut it and you twist and what I do I mean what I did here is I just buy some uh, window screen you can get at your local Menard store okay 
and the reason why I put this uh, window screens on just to protect some rock or some leaf or bigger object okay so all you have to do is mounting the bracket into the chassis that I already have a 10 millimeter drill hole right here that's all you have to do very simple see very simple but in order to get this piece out you have to break the box okay remember there's a big box right here an intact big box you have to take out the box remove it and break it to get this piece inside okay this piece is actually inside and then you cut it and then you're facing this way to get the air go inside very simple and this is how you customize see, it's very solid when you mount this when you tight this 10 millimeter here this intake here is very solid okay so now you get the cold air intake you you get the cold air from from under going up okay and this is the best setup that close to the CT engineer and intake okay if you uh take a closer look on their design similar idea okay but you don't have to spend over 180 bucks you can use your stocks okay so hopefully this helped many of you okay and thank you for watching so I'm gonna put everything together okay thank you